It's time to find the traitor amongst the council in the council chambers in Remnant 2. What's up, YouTube Zero here? And today, I'm going to help you solve who the traitor is in the council chambers in Remnant 2. In this video, I'm only going to show you the steps to get to the traitor in Remnant 2. I'm not going to show you the battles or anything else inside of this chamber. So first, you're going to come across this side dungeon in Remnant 2. You're going to talk to the council and they're going to tell you there's a traitor amongst their myths. As you go around the council chambers, there is a entire loop. You will eventually come across a mirror that takes you to the council tribunal, which is a mirror dimension of the council chambers. Now, once you get here, be aware there are going to be a couple of enemies that attack you almost immediately, but this is going to be a mirror dimension of where you just came from. Now, you're going to go into the council chambers, the mirrored version of the council chambers. The council members aren't going to be in here, but this is where you're going to start your puzzle. Now, do note... Below you is going to be glass, so you can actually walk up to where the council members would sit. You're going to notice there are actually these flags or these keys that are on the podiums where the council members sit. You're going to have to place these keys in the right slots. When you first come across them, they're not in the correct slot. So if you look at the podiums and then look down, the reflection will tell you where these keys are supposed to be located. Now, it was hard for me to see the symbol, but I utilized the color so I could place the keys in the right slot. So I have blue lined up with blue. Then I see a pink and an orange. So orange for me is going to be in the middle. And then the final one, of course, because I've already utilized the other two, is going to be this pinkish purple. After you place the keys in the right slot, the king's chamber is going to open up. Remember, we're trying to find which council member aided in putting the king to sleep. So, the king's chamber opens up. Now, when you go into this chamber, there are going to be a couple of items that you can find. One, there's going to be a chest to the right. If you're looking at the mini-map, you can see the chest which lit up on my mini-map. So, that's where the chest is going to be. But you're going to want to climb these steps that are right next to the king. And I would go to the left. You can see I tried on the right and I couldn't latch on to the ledge behind the king. So go to the left of the king. Jump over and you'll find the assassin's seal ring. So now you have a ring. Now you want to go behind the king himself. Turn and you want to jump across onto the ledge because... Right in the back of the king is going to be the assassin dagger. Be aware after you get the assassin dagger, there are going to be enemies that come into this room, so you're going to have to take them out. But after you take them out and get that chest, you can go back to the council members. Now, the way you can solve this puzzle now that you have the assassin's dagger is you want to go inspect the dagger. And on the bottom of the dagger is going to be a symbol. This is who the traitor is amongst the council. So you want to look at the keys on the podium to match up what symbol is on the bottom of the dagger. And that's going to be your traitor. Do note that you cannot accuse a council member without the appropriate dagger and evidence against the traitor because if you do they won't believe you you have to have the evidence but after you do get the dagger you come back and you accuse a council member you will be handsomely rewarded after they agree with you the rest of the council agrees with you so that's how you solve this council puzzle i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did feel free to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more Remnant 2 content. I do a bunch of other RPGs, so feel free to check those out as well. Until next time, peace.